Hi there, everyone. This is Mailman Zero, playing another Nintendo classic from my childhood, RC Pro-Am. I still am a little bit confused about how I got this game. I think my grandmother came over one time and just had it. So anyway, this is um, a game where I pushed the wrong button to begin with. But uh, it's a, it's sort of a... I don't want to say diagonal, but it's sort of a, you know, a top-down RC racing game. Kind of like a later games Micro Machines. But uh, this game, you know, you, you go around and you try to beat the other cars and you get these boosts and things. And if you get first place, you get extra points. You look here, you get a trophy. That's a gold trophy because I got first place. Things you pick up on the track, there's sticky tires and some engine enhancements and other things. Um, there I just uh, passed up on something very important which would be the rocket launchers. Rockets are awesome because they allow you to shoot enemies that are in front of you. Of course, they're not just competitors, they are enemies. See, that was close. It's it's very easy not to get a first place in this game. Even if you're good. So there are a couple of other interesting things that you can get. Oh, see, up here, these... Okay, there's just so much stuff going on. The red things obviously make you go fast. Uh, the white things... I don't know what to call them, they, they kind of... They kind of look like, uh... I don't know, the thing that keeps your pizza box from hitting your pizza. They give you some uh, temporary invincibility that also hurts other cars when they run into you. Um, you'll notice there's an N at the bottom of the screen. You collect letters on the track. When you get enough letters to spell out Nintendo, then you get a new car design. Oh, see, I just got a different weapon, which could backfire on me. Get it? Backfire? It comes out of my backside. It's like backfire. See, I don't want to hit that guy, and now I am in fourth place. If I were to finish right now, I would lose. Oh, see, look at that. Run into him, makes me spin around, and then I crash into the side of something, and I die. And just like that, I get third place. But I'm still in the running. See, I did. I was so close to fourth place. Let's see if we can make it up on this one. See, they put me in a worse spot now because of that. All right, that's a good start right there. Start out with some invincibility. Try to get the enemy to run into me. See, I think I hit him with that one. Oh man, I was not paying attention on that turn. All it takes is one false move. Ah, oh, three laps. So nerve-wracking. Yes! See, if it wasn't for those weapons, I don't think I would have been able to pull this off. But there we go, a first place win. So, you know, this is just like those other games. Most racing games, I don't even know why they even give you a brake pedal, because, you know, you never want a brake pedal. You want to be going as fast as possible all the time. Oh man. Yeah, that first place guy has got to be way out there, because I've been just missing these like crazy. Phew. At least I'm not... In fourth place. Alright. See if we can make some time up here. Probably not though, because once you miss that, I mean, you're... you're not doing so hot. Alright! I actually made it back in first. That is like a, a miracle of video gaming right there. Oh wow. That's what I call a comeback. 
That trophy at the top, I think, means I'm in like fifth place overall or something. I'm not really sure. Okay, so this one has added a beautiful new thing. Those you can run into because sometimes they come up in the middle of the road, you know, just like a regular race. You know, everyone loves a, a race that's got things you can run into in the middle of the road that pop up that don't make any sense. It would never actually appear in a real race. Come on. Yes. Oh, now I'm almost out, though. That was a close one. Second place, not too bad. I can handle that. Give me a silver trophy. My first silver, but I'm still four. Like, maybe it just means that I'm four away from like the end of this time. You know, I honestly haven't played this in I don't know, fifteen years maybe. I don't know any of the tracks anymore, really. What I do know is that I'm in third place and not doing very well. Also, it's interesting. These sound effects are a lot more annoying to me now than they were when I was a kid. I mean, I guess they were never really all that appealing, but... Wow, this is just like Screech City. No wonder my parents hated Nintendo no noises and sound effects. Of course, nowadays I really like the music from Nintendo, but I have to say, this sound effect really is obnoxious. <laughs> Alright. What can we do here? That guy's overtaking us for no apparent reason. I have no idea how he did that. But, you know, he's hitting some oil slicks. That's good for us. Now Mr. Orange is on top for no apparent reason again. Oh, come on! Oh, I thought that was the last lap! Oh, I wish that were the last lap. Because now I'm in fourth place. And all I have is weapons that shoot behind me, which is... Only good if you're not in fourth place. Okay. Well, that'll hopefully at least give me a third place finish. This final straightaway here. Wow. That was close. If I hadn't got that one guy before, I don't know what would have happened there. It's a good start. Get as many of those as possible. Oh man, there's a lot of, you know, super arrows on this track, and I'm missing most of them. Just missed another one. Don't touch that guy! Oh, I missed another one. This is not good! I don't have any weapons left. I actually got first place on that, which makes no sense. That was the luckiest finish ever. I'm not really sure why the bottom of the screen's cut off. I don't know if it did that on the original Nintendo, or if that's just the emulator. I kind of think that maybe the original Nintendo did that, though. I don't know. It doesn't make sense, why would it be cut off, but whatever. So lots of slowdowns here, for uh, lots of oil slicks. You gotta be careful, because if you hit an oil slick and then run into the wall, you crash. Alright. A big silver tire trophy. I really need to get some more power-ups. Like that. Or I could completely miss everything, that's always good too. Man. I shouldn't be missing everything every time. I, I ran over that, I don't know how I missed that. Ooh. Well, you do have a continue in this game, but I'll use this opportunity to say. Thanks for watching, 
and uh, I'll just put in my initials here. Guess I'll use MMO. I'm a massively multiplayer online something. Maybe you don't actually get to continue in this game now that I think about it. Well, in any case, this is Mailman Zero saying join me next time. Bye.